Right guys, here we are, episode 14 of the Road to Retirement series with Fabio Quagliarella and we are at the end of the season. We have four matches left, uh, the first of which is Milan as you can see and we will certainly be playing that one. But it looks like we'll be playing all four in this episode as we've also got Lazio, Napoli and Udinese to take on. So let's get to it. Right guys, so here we go, chasing down that fourth place, uh, trying to get the best of the rest effectively for Sampdoria as we face off here against Milan at home. Ball pass there by De Rossi. Well done by Buffon there to come out and collect that from the feet of the onrushing striker. Over the top here. Quagliarella, oh, Reina catches it with his feet, puts it out for a corner, and we try again. Go on, Sandro. Draws the foul, and we get ourselves a free kick. Three day inside Quagliarella what a goal there a brilliant team effort lovely through ball to Matuidi Matuidi unselfishly knocks it back across the goal to find Quagliarella who smashes it home 1-0 great delivery by Matuidi back into the box Quagliarella is a no look finish Bad ball there by Lichsteiner. But that brings the half to an end and we are 1-0 up here against AC Milan at home. Come on, Lichsteiner. Run that line. Can he deliver a decent ball into the box? He can and Quag hits the bar. Ah, oh, Ronaldo levelled on the edge of the box. Gets nothing for his troubles though. Inside to Matuidi. Back out to Sandro. He'll play it down the line here to Levetsi. Back inside. Matuidi knocks it into the box. Ronaldo there waiting to nod one home. Another great team goal there. Pass and move. Tweedy once again getting involved with the chip ball into the box to find one of his strikers. And it's Ronaldo this time just nodding one home. A rose between two thorns there as the two defenders can't get to Ronaldo. Play the long through ball out from defence there, didn't quite come off. Milan here, oh, getting in, but Richie, who's just come on, manages to get himself between Suso and the goal, and he's prevented it and sent it out for a corner. He didn't send it out for a corner, he's actually got himself a goal kick. Great stuff by the youngster. Sandro once again mopping up for the rest of the guys who lost out in that exchange and there we go it is a 2-0 victory here at home against Milan that is a great result as we try to get through the last part of this season and Quagliarella is extremely happy with that one Okay, so this second game of the episode is at Lazio. Let's get on with this one, guys, and see if we can get a decent result on the road. Get that ball. Great ball there by Matuidi. Can he, Ribéry, find Quagliarella? He does make the, a very good attempt at that, but can't get the ball into the box for our striker. Oh, suicide. Oh, great. Great stuff by Buffon. Saves our blushes. A 
And Luke Steiner there, knocking the ball out of play. Oh! Getting behind there, but it's Lucas with the effort. And to be honest, we all know he doesn't score many goals, so. Sigh of relief as Buffon turns that round the post. Mobley to the back post. That is extremely lucky that we haven't gone 1 0 down there. Rossi driving forward, looking for a man to pass off to, but gets himself a free kick instead. Tweedy takes one from range. Had to take the snapshot there and he did drive it, but it wasn't on target, unfortunately. Well done there by Ribery to hold that up and get Sandro away. Comes across. Matweedy once more with another effort from the edge of the box. Fell nicely to him. And he just simply pulled the trigger. Brat rolls his man, gets into the box, looks across the box to Quagliarella, and he's there. The two older statesmen of the team line up to get that goal. Yes. It's been all Lazio, and we've absorbed their pressure throughout. Got ourselves a couple of chances before the half time break here, and Unbelievable by Ibrahimovic there to turn his man. Knocks it across the box to find Quagliarella, who's obviously going to be there to batter it home. 1 0. Sandro! Oh, what a ball into the box, but we couldn't quite get there. Left out itself, maybe a little bit exposed at the back here. Trying to get back into shape, but that is an absolutely diabolical ball there from Lucas out wide to Immobile. He gets it into the box, but Buffon comes out to get to the rescue. And that is it, half time, and we've gone into this one 1 0 up. De Rossi pulls the trigger from distance, looks for a man, he's found Quagliarella. but Quag loses out to Lucas there on the edge of the box, and now we'll have to ch help chase back. Because he knows he's lost possession. <laughs> and he's the one who regains it. Really good work there from Quagliarella as he chased that ball back down, having lost possession in the beginning. Go on, Quag. Oh, he tries to dink him. No! Well done, Richie. Having come off the bench, the youngster there saving us on the edge of the box from that shot from Yo Mario. Great as he pushes that round the post. Great stuff. The captain and the manager sacrifices himself here as he brings on Ronaldo for the last few minutes of this game. Oh, Ronaldo. And that's it. We've managed to get ourselves another victory here on the road this time against Lazio. That's a really good result and should ensure that we get close to that fourth place position that we are looking for. Right guys, here we go. It's time for another important game as we are at home in this one as we face off against Napoli. De Rossi across to Matuidi. Long range punt. <laughs> Rossi looking for somebody, can't find what he's looking for, so goes back here to Licksteiner. Comes out to Levetzi. Oh, Levetzi loses out. Should have done so much better there. Second guessing his own choices as Zaha gets himself away down the line here. He's rapid. And Lichsteiner has taken him out. 
I don't know what the hell was going on there. Rapid throw out there for it to Ibrahimovic and he finds Matuidi up over the top with a lob through ball. Back into Ibra, he's got space in the box. Goes down. Ref! 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 Ibra's now injured. But he's like, I'm going to smash this game anyway. Nice effort from distance from Ibrahimovic. Outside of the boot. Keeper does well to push it round. Ooh, keeper just about comes out for that one. Levetsi. Oh, Mere there making a fabulous save as De Rossi pulls the trigger from distance. Sorry, Levetsi pulls the trigger from distance. What an effort. And what a save. Long raking ball there from Matuidi. Can we keep it in? Yes, we can. Lovetsi doing exceptionally well there. Ibra. Yes. Bided his time on the edge of the box. Waited for the space to open up. And then pulls the trigger and bangs one home. 1-0 just ahead of half time. Great stuff from Ibrahimovic. And to be honest, winning that ball by Lovetsi out wide was the thing that triggered that whole move. Look at that outside of the foot shot. Started it out from her outside the post and pulls it in. Great goal. Quite loves it too. And there we go. We go into the half time break. 1 0 up here against Napoli. Pace Merchant trying to get away down the wing, but it's Levetsi there to prevent that. He's playing really well again today here on the right-hand side. Andro, oh, just overcooked it a little bit. Out of position now as well, though, so Ronaldo's trying to fill in for him. Buffon's come all the way out for that. Zaha saw that as an opportunity to take one from distance, but it's gone up and over the bar. A Tweedy. Oh, Sandro. Good block by Lichsteiner. Levetsi tries to get it away, but he's pinged it out to the... Napoli player there and Mertens on the volley knocks one wide. Out. Oh, what an effort there from Zaha. He loves a ping from distance, doesn't he? Ricci had it covered. Back to Ricci. And that's it. It's another victory here for Sampdoria as we try to close out this season on a high. We beat Napoli 1-0. Zaha had a bag full of chances in that game and couldn't convert anything. But our man Zlatan, he got himself on the score sheet. And we took the victory. As we head towards the last game of the season. Right guys, here we go, last game of the season and we face off against Udinese in this one. But to grab that fourth position we need results to go our way in the other games. So, we are currently sitting in fifth place and chasing that fourth position but Roma occupy it at the moment and they face off against Sassolo. Oh, we should have scored, should have scored. A Tweedy there, getting himself in the box but not able to convert oh, done the tweet. oh come on ref 
Owen. Really? A yellow card for that? I don't think so. Oh, come on. Not worth a yellow card, surely. 36 yards out here for Udinese. What can they come up with? Absolutely zero is the answer. Ronaldo drives through. Finds Matuidi and Matuidi makes up for his previous miss and that yellow card and drives that into the bottom right hand corner. Good goal as we drive forward. Get a result here against Udinese. Ronaldo bumbling his way through, getting it across the box into Matuidi's path and Matuidi just slotting that ball home. Good goal there. Second row. Into De Rossi. De Rossi finds Matuidi. Matuidi finds Quagliarella. Oh, he should have finished it. And he should have finished the second opportunity as well. But he's drawn it into the base of the post. Go on, Ribéry. Go on, Ribéry. Oh, my God. What a goal that would have been. As he smashes it against the post. Quagliarella. Doing some chase back work there, showing to the team what he expects of them. Getting himself back in position for this long range effort. But he's driven over the top by the goalkeeper. Also, and the eye of the referee once more. Lichsteiner. Out! Wag. And that is it, that is half time. Luckily, Matuidi escapes. The referee's glances as we go into the dressing room. Go on, Frank. Light lightning here, Frank. Gets it into the box and Ronaldo. Pick that out. That is great work by Ribéry to get that ball into Ronaldo. Can't discount the effort there that was took by Ribéry to get down the line, get to the byline and get that ball into the box. And then Ronaldo comes in and just drops his head up past the goalkeeper. Done by Matuidi and we're away on the break into Quagliarella. Oh, what the hell is that Quag? Goes out for a goal kick. Cool as you like from Silva. Oh, dribbles through. The Tweedy though picks up the pieces. Knocks it back to Buffon and Buffon calmly gets rid of it. Breca there. Putting one into the side netting. effort there from the edge of the box as that calls the curtain down on the end of this game and we are victorious it is a, another 2-0 victory here for Sampdoria against Udinese and hopefully let's see what happened at the other games around the rest of Serie A to see if we have managed to claw back fourth position so there we go guys, we've a really decent running at the end of this uh, season, we've managed to get ourselves the Manager of the Month award. Okay, so as we look to round out this episode, I'd just like to let you know where we finished in the league. We didn't quite get to the level of Roma, unfortunately they were too far adrift from us, so they got 78 points, we managed to get 76 and to be honest, an exceptional uh, performance for us in this season. Uh, obviously doesn't hold a candle to the likes of Juventus who finished the 
uh, season on 100 points and Inter on 97 points. But it does mean that we do have European football next season and we do have Messi and Vidal coming in. And let me know in the comment section down below who we should be looking to sign for season three in FIFA 20. I think we need some supporting uh, back at the back. Uh, we've only got a couple of centre backs in the form of Silva and Chiellini. And Lichsteiner also does tend to get tired quite often throughout the season. So if you've got any ideas of who we should be signing, please do let me know and we will see about getting them into the squad for next season. Well, all I've got left to say for this episode is if you have enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel for more FIFA 20 content. But for now, I'm out of here.